What's going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's been a while. I have today an unboxing to do. I picked up some Nintendo DS and 3DS games from someone. Uh, I had bought them from him before. I picked up Kirby's Return to Dreamland and Super Mario Galaxy 2 about a year ago from the same seller. It was kind of cool because he contacted me asking if I wanted games and I was like, uh, hell yeah, I want games. So he sent me some pictures of what he has and this is what I picked out. I did sell a Nintendo Switch, a version 2, so that gave me the money for this, which was great. Yeah, without further ado, let's just get into it. I'm gonna pull them out one by one. Let's start off with DS. Got Mario Party DS. God, I remember playing this game on the school bus with friends with DS download play. What a good time this was. Man. And they are complete. There's a little bit of damage on the artwork on this one, but not a big deal. It is complete in box. So we got the manual. Something you never see anymore, which kind of sucks, but... And then you got just the other stuff in here. Nintendo Power, or Register of Software, I guess. And then other great games. So that's Mario Party DS. Excited to pop that in and try it out. It's been a long time. This next one here, I didn't see this in the pictures which kind of sucks, but the case is kind of messed. <laughs> I can get a different case for it. I have a couple good donor cases, which is nice. This is Fossil Fighters, another one I had as a kid. It's a lot like Pokemon, so that's interesting. If you're a dinosaur fan, this is definitely something interesting to pick up. One did not come with the manual, I don't think, but I bought one on eBay, so that's coming in the mail. So got that. Got all the proper paperwork, and I think there's a couple extra of these. I don't know. I have to freaking get a different case for this one. Oh well, at least I have extra cases. Next up, we have Mario vs. Donkey Kong Mini Land Mayhem. I uh, kind of want to give the Donkey Kong Mario vs. Donkey Kong games a try, since the one is coming out on Switch early next year. But this one's in great shape, and again, complete. The manual here, Club Nintendo, and the precautions booklets. Yeah, Mario vs. DK. Next up, one of the uh, bigger ones that I was excited for. <laughs> this is Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks, and it looks like it is pristine. Like, it looks great. I cannot complain one bit about this one. I've never owned this game. I've never owned it. I had a friend in school that loved it, and I remember seeing him play it a little bit, but that's the extent of my knowledge on this game. I know nothing about it, and to be honest, I want to give the DS games a fair, sh uh, fair shot because I kind of uh, passed them up back in the day. So, very beautiful manual. God, I miss game manuals so much. And uh, this is cool. This is a lot of good games on this one. This is a series I'm wanting to finish up, Mario and Luigi. Which, by the way, I have one of the games coming in the mail. Uh, I might do a short of that when I get it. I have a big pickups video. Well, I shouldn't say big, but I have a decent-sized pickups video I want to do of all the stuff I've grabbed in the last bit. There's quite a bit of stuff, so I was going to wait and do this with it, but I decided to just unbox it right now, because why not? 3DS games, Fire Emblem Awakening. Not historically a big Fire Emblem fan, but I've heard this one's one of the best ones to uh, start playing. I have, which one is it? I have Conquest on the 3DS as well, but um, I haven't really put much time into it. So maybe I could get into Awakening. That'd be great. Again, manual. And I find the cartridges really cool for these games. They're kind of like pixel art. But yeah. Pokemon Omega Ruby. This is one that I did own. I've never owned Alpha Sapphire. But really, really want to get into the traditional Pokemon games. I've never really gotten into them myself. 
I do like Legends Arceus and Scarlet and Violet, so maybe I can get into these older games now that I have some Pokemon experience, because I just never played it as a kid, which sounds kind of crazy, but yeah, I, I was never a Pokemon kid. Ending it, we have Pokemon Ultra Sun. I remember <laughs> I got this game for Christmas one year. What year would that have been? 20... 17? Probably 2017. I had it sealed on my shelf until I sold my collection. I never did play it, so it should be kind of cool to go through if I can get uh, the time to do it. So that's Pokemon Ultra Sun, which is the enhanced version of Sun and Moon. Uh, late 3DS game, you can tell because the uh, Nintendo Red branding there. But I do also have Pokemon sun the regular version so there's the difference in the cover arts this is supposed to be the way better version thank you guys so much for watching this video if you enjoyed remember to leave a like thank you so much for the large influx in subscribers lately i'm at 470 something as of this video the shorts i've been putting out have been doing fairly well so thank you to everybody new that happens to uh check out this video i really appreciate it but I will see you guys in the next video. It should be a pickups video, I want to say in a week or so, once everything I'm getting gets here. So stay tuned for that, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.